Just spoke with town manager Don Noyes, and she says that the resolution, which was passed unanimously by the select board on Monday, is only intended to address Governor Mills' mask mandates as it applies to people with disabilities who live in the town here. But the resolution, which was submitted by an outside group, the language in it doesn't entirely match what the town manager told us. It states that the governor's executive order to wear face masks in public is a violation of their constitutional rights and goes beyond the Americans with Disabilities Act, the group Beacon for Sovereignty pushed this and uh, proposed it to the board and it was accepted according to selectmen that we spoke to unchanged. People with disabilities aren't being treated fairly in that act because she's basically saying that if you have a disability it doesn't matter you're going to wear a mask anyway and some people just can't do that. Kim Moody, the executive director of Disability Rights Maine, says that she is disappointed with the resolution which was passed and referred to it as a misguided form of civil disobedience. Reporting live in Paris, Terry Stackhouse, WMTW News 8.